Let's talk about some of your past projects because you've worked on some really cool stuff that people will recognize the names of yeah. those things. So, you know, yeah. just kind of give a, a little rundown and which which was your favorite or which were your favorite projects that you've worked on? I've always asked, uh, I, I mean, originally, I think I'm, a, I'm an indie developer f at heart. Uh, <laughs> so, so the thing that I like the most, the project that I like the most doing definitely has to be Child of Light, hands down. Um, it was, it was weird times, I guess, um, THQ Montreal just went down under, got bought back by Ubisoft. Um, they were pitching all the projects that were going on on the floor at, at Ubisoft Montreal back then so that they would get all the stuff from THQ there and and kind of distribute us uh, to, to, to all those projects. And um, one of the assistants, I guess, they really wanted me in to, to jump in with them. But um, I saw, you know, the the prototype for child of light it was fairly early in the production when i got in touch with those guys and i was like who i want to get in there and i think that the people on the project also really liked uh my personality and what i could bring so the rest is history as they say uh, we went in there for i don't know close to two years or maybe yeah and what it was, was it uh, about that one that that you liked so much it is somewhat of a of a love letter to to making games. I would say that game and and it's definitely what was happening on the floor as well, right? It was really crafts people, you know, exercising exercising their craft and and as good as they could do it within the limits of the engine that we were using and all of that. But at the same point. At the same time, it was it was very much about you know a core gameplay loop, and so it was very you know making games in its purest form without all the shenanigans that you might expect with <laughs> bigger productions and and bigger studios and whatnot. Even even I guess we were in the funhouse, uh, which is like a separate building, separate atmosphere. It was not really uh, a Ubisoft game to some extent, if you want to put it. I say way. it all the time that I love being part of a small scrappy team more than being part of a big corporate machine.